Hi, and welcome to this edition of the Empty Nesters Finally YouTube um, video. Anyway, so this week we're going to talk about communication in the nest, which you think would be so much time we would have everything available to us, but there's different stages of communication. Like when you first get engaged, you want to know everything you can about the other person. And it's so important that you can figure out if you truly want to spend the rest of your life with that person. I mean, in all honesty, like if Brad would have told me that he only likes to use big pens, I would have thought that was the most fascinating thing in the world. Fascinating. He could, he could have told me anything. And I just would have thought that I would have jumped off the highest building for him because he was the most important person to me. Then, you, then we had actually gone and heard a rabbi speak, and he said that, 10 minutes of conversation is so important in a relationship. And we're like looking at each other like. Yeah, you have plenty of, t more than 10 minutes. Yeah, like he's nuts. Like we could do 10 minutes. That's easy. Then we had Lane and Drew. Oh, and we love Lane and Drew. You know, obviously. Yes, we do love Lane and we Drew. We love Lane and Drew. And we're then glad they uh, joined the family. And then it became what he meant, 10 minutes of conversation. He meant like really in-depth conversation. And with them, it was more like, can you take them to karate? Did they take a bath? Yeah, more logistical things and not really, not really the conversation about, what's Us. your, yeah, about what's your favorite color? Green. No. Karen's favorite okay. color is, we'll get to that later. <laughs> and, I'm still trying to figure that, <laughs> that one out. And then you become empty nesters and then you realize that now you going back to the conversations you kind of had when you were engaged, the in-depth conversations, but you really don't want to know. Like, honestly, like, I could care less what type of pen he uses, although I think he likes gel pens now. Right? Yes, we do. But in all honesty, it's really how you want to live the rest of your life because you know that you found the person that you love so much and, and that you want that pen and that you – where do you want to live? How do you want to live? Like – how do you want to spend time with your family, your parents, your grandkids, your kids? Those are the important conversations to have. Um, and even though Brad would probably like a little less conversation. <laughs> to quote uh, the famous philosopher Elvis Presley, a little less conversation. Um, a little more action. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so what I'm saying to you is, as an empty communicate. Talk. Talk and, and, and talk about the little stuff. Talk about what their favorite pen is or what their favorite color is. But really talk about the big stuff because it's your family, you know. And don't forget, it's important to have a cup of coffee with each other in the morning. Thank and, you, Wawa. Thank you, Wawa. And, and, and just get to the tough stuff because even though there might be some awkward silences, Brad probably likes, looks forward to the awkward silences. Those are very exciting. Just realize that in it's the like end. Like a nap during those awkward silences. <laughs> it's easy. Just no one <laughs> And by the way, Karen's favorite color is purple. Close, but in all honesty, yes, it is. Because you know what? Whatever he says my favorite color is, it's not worth it. You've got to remember pick your fights, pick your battles, also. That's an also a big thing with us. I don't care if he doesn't know my favorite color. <laughs> That's for a discussion off camera, everybody. <laughs> anyway, I know that I've mentioned this before. You have lists and everything that you can go back to if you have, have need conversation starters. And if you need ours, you know they're available for a small fee. I'll put that on my show notes. Everyone has show notes. I'll put that yeah. on my show notes. <laughs> and I'll have conversation starters and just communicate. Be nice to each other. Don't worry about the awkward silences. I love this girl. Happy empty nesting. Happy nesting and I, didn't, I didn't even tell him to say that. Happy All right, buddy. Have a great day. Bye. Bye. Empty